Hello kids, uh, welcome to another video by Gyan Lab. You must have studied in school that a plus b whole cube is equal to a cube plus b cube plus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared. And your teacher must have asked you to just memorize it. We will not do it this way. And so today I have some very basic cubes and cuboids with me which we will use to understand why a plus b whole cube is equal to a cube plus b cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square. Alright, so let's get started. I have with me this big yellow cube. Alright, so uh, I just draw its three dimensional shape on the board. And I will call each side as A because it's a cube, so all sides are supposed to be equal. And when I find the volume of this, that is equal to A cube. My next shape is the little cube that I have here in red, and I'll show I'll I'll draw this shape as well on the board. Like a little cube over here. And I'll call every side as B. So the volume for this becomes B cube. Now the black shape that you see here, it's a cuboid. So we have two faces which are equal and third face which is not. And incidentally, these sides are equal to the yellow block that we have seen. So each side here is A and A. And this side is equal to the side of the smaller cube. Okay, so when we draw the shape of this cuboid here, what we see is, well, this is A, this is A, and this is B. So now the volume of this shape becomes A square B. And finally, I have the white cuboid, where two of the smaller sides are equal, and the third side is not. Now if I draw it in the frame, Here you see this is A, this is B and this is B. So the volume of this figure becomes AB square. So the fundamental shapes that we drew on the board are A cube, B cube, there are 3 A square B, as you remember A, A into B and 3 a B square A into B into B right so we'll now assemble this together right so I place my a cube on the board and I keep a black cuboid standing next to it I keep another black cuboid standing next to it and I keep on top right so as you can see I place the three black cuboids around the yellow cube that's a cube and now to fill the gaps I put three of the white ones and there's just a bit amount of space left for me to put the B cube in this frame so we have a perfect cube again All right? and now if you measure each side, this is A plus B, okay, and this is also A plus B, and this is also A plus B. Hence, the cube that we have here is A plus B, the breadth and the height as A plus B. So now, what is the volume of the shape? It is A plus B into A plus B into A plus B. So you have an A plus B whole cube. All right. Now it's as simple as that. Now. Now we all have to do is add up all the shapes. Alright, so we made our A plus B whole cube using four different shapes. So we had first the yellow cube with the volume A cube. The small red cube with the volume B cube. The black big cuboid, we used three units of it to form our structure and each one of them had 
a volume of a square b and the white small cubes that we used also had a volume of also used three uh, three units were used and had the volume a b square so we will simply add and find what is a plus b whole cube so we have a cube plus b cube and since we use three units of this so the volume becomes 3 a square b and this becomes 3 a b square right and this is equal to a plus b whole cube now it's as simple as this you do not need to memorize it you do not need to do anything just remember the four cubes how the volume came out and this is the final formula that you have and i'm pretty sure you'll never forget it again thank you